one of my favorites, guys. Love this video. Expert. Some say guru on small and mid-sized businesses. Michael Gerber has written seven books on the E-Myth and has coached 30,000 business owners on how to build a world-class business. Man. Well, thanks for having us up here, Michael. I guess we'll start with, what is the E-Myth? E-Myth is the entrepreneurial myth. And essentially it says that people who go into business are not the entrepreneurs that everybody believes them to be. But what I've come to know as technicians suffering from an entrepreneur seizure. So the doctor opens up a medical practice, the attorney a legal practice, the software guy a software business, the hardware guy a hardware business, each of them believing because they know how to do the work, the software, the, the medicine, the law, they know how to build a business that does that work. And it's just completely not true. What can they do differently? Well, you'd go to work, as the e says, on your business, as opposed to in your business, like Ray Kroc did it. First prototype, and then he stood outside of it, not inside of it, and watched the little sucker work. When it didn't work, he knew that it was a problem with the system, not with the person. So he went to work like Deming would say, on the system, not on the person. The person's never the problem. The system is. The technician doesn't know that. You understand? That's what the EMS is all about. Go to work on it, not in it. To build the foolproof system that any ordinary person can produce extraordinary results over and over and over again and continually improve it, continually innovation, quantification, and orchestration. It's a ball game. So I'm saying to every single person who's listening in, you get the first one right. You get your sales system right when you're small. You get your um, lead generation system right when you're small. You get your lead conversion system right when small, knowing that you're going to be big, and that because you're going to be big, it's absolutely critical that you've gotten it right so that you can replicate it tens of thousands of times. Can you give us sort of a brief example of the seven disciplines that are in your book? Well, um, in my latest book, Myth Mastery, I talk about the seven essential disciplines of a world-class company, and they're really entrepreneurial First of those is the discipline of the enterprise leader. The second is the discipline of the marketing leader. The third is the discipline of the financial leader. The fourth is the discipline of the management leader. And then there's lead generation, lead conversion, and client fulfillment. And each of those are a, a position of leadership that someone Check this 